this is uh, the first video for January 2024. And as you can see the title, it says, Give Caesar to Caesar and what belongs to God, give it to God. This series is focused on my spiritual journey. I'm taking it back to the basics. Um, and what do you mean back to the basics? Well, um, I have so many ways to start this video and there's no other way. Um, as you can know, you know me on the budget family. I like to use real numbers, real concrete, even a little picture to tell you my story. And I'm hoping that I could do the same thing here in the spiritual way. So just, just bear with me here, okay? So, so what I'm trying to say is that I wanna go from basic spiritual journey up to where I am right now. I am, I grew another level in the spiritual journey and I, don't know how to go up from there and I will tell you more detail about what I'm trying to say here in other videos after this one so this is my introduction to my spiritual journey I there was a video in my budget that I was I show you that I was reading two books these two books and uh, the way of perfection yeah I want to be perfect. I want to be perfect as a human being. And what other way to learn from God and Jesus? And you might not believe, but the only reason I'm in YouTube world is because of God. Okay. So I might lose you here. Just bear with me to the end, but I'm going to continue the series until I say what I need to say and let it be God's will to spread it <laughs> because what is my fear? My fear is that uh, Jesus says this parable, you know, there was a farmer who had three workers and the first worker he gave one talent, the second two or three and the third one he gave five. And the farmer, a.k.a. Jesus, went away and he came back, yeah, after a long time. And the first one, you know, the first one didn't go that well with Jesus because not to say it didn't go well, it's just that, you know, it's not that he got well. The thing is that he gave this talent to this person and he didn't use it. He didn't use it. Why? We don't know. But I think I know. A fear of other people might say uh, not to have the courage to do so, not to come out. Here I am. Um... And this is the reason I, I want to do, I, what I want, this is what I want. I will die one day. I'm going to meet Jesus and I want him to say, well done. Now I did this video three times and I always start crying. So there's no other way. There's no other way. So if you see these tears, don't worry. I am not sad. It's just the way I am. I, this is my fourth. This is my fourth video doing this. So I'm just going to push through. <laughs> I'm going to smile. I'm going to let it go. Let it go. Because that's what I want. So in this journey, I will be focusing in the Bible, the Word of God. I also going to branch through the two books that I mentioned earlier in my budget series, there was a video there that I was saying the two books, the goals for the month that I wanted to do is to read two books. I'm in the middle of St. Teresa of Avila. Also, uh, St. Mary Faustina, uh, the di her diary. Um, 
and why I'm just branching those. Those are going to be different videos and my personal experience. You know, I just want to express myself and I, I did that approach like full force right in your face and it didn't work. So I'm doing a different approach in a softer, more delicate way, more love. I'm showing it through love. I am taking this book. It's a budget, not budget, I'm into budget. It's a bullet, it's a bullet. And I wanna, I'm into arts. I, that's who I am. Uh, I wanna get better. I wanna get better before it's too late for me. I want to express the art and the communication I get. It's the communication, the images that I get in dreams and visions in this book. And this is the series I am going to draw. Images, stories, if it's just one sentence, one word he likes to give me one word yeah <laughs> he's funny he's funny he's i want to show that to you who he is through my eyes so that's that's what it is i want to show you god through pictures through my eyes how i see him to share with you this is my way to express my love for him Shattered on top of the mountains through love. I am not going to go straight deep because I've done that um, very quickly in the last few. How did it all start? It started eight years ago. Eight years ago. Okay, so if I start crying, this is, this is where I get stuck. But if you know who I am through the budget family, you know I like to pop things, give you real numbers, real situations. Here we go with the situation. But it's God. How how can I prove that to you? Um, only through the only story I have that I might be able to prove it. Take it as it is. It's just it's a a spiritual journey. And, um, okay, so here we go. <sighs> Eight years ago, I was a baby. I am, I was a baby in like, you know, um, how St. Paul says, your spiritual journey, you start as a baby. You, you're crying. You're like babble, you know, babbling when it comes to the spiritual the spiritual journey, your spiritual journey or your relationship with God is a baby. So I was a baby back then, but I'm feisty. I am, as you can see, my personality, I one day, I decided, I read the first sentence of the Bible a long time ago, and I decided I believe it. As the first sentence of the Bible. Are you going to believe it or not? I decided to believe it. And then I started reading more of the Bible. And I got more acquainted with God, with his words. And it may, mainly you know that the more you read the Bible, more personal you become. It's like a mirror to your soul. And um, I became feisty and I said... Okay, God, I believe in you. I believe everything you say. Now, mind you, this is the beginning. <laughs> and I said, I am your daughter. And I know I'm not Moses. I know I'm not David. I know I am nothing. I am nothing. I am not worth even the dirt. But I said, I am your daughter. And I want to know who you are. Now, I, I said it with more emotion. I was clear in mind, body, and soul. And that night, he visited me. <sighs> he visited me. Oh, he visited me. 
because I said I demanded it. Now, I'm not saying that this will work with you. I don't know. I'm not going to sit here and tell you how he... How, I am not. <laughs> no. God, no one understands the... It's, there's a saying, no one knows the understanding of God, only his own spirit. Okay. Let me breathe because I have to tell you this message. That night I had a dream, vision. Once again, I am nobody. I'm just a Christian woman and daughter of God. I'm gonna go there because I wanna start crying. I this is my fourth video. I have to push through. <laughs> I have to push through, okay. So he visited me. Guys, it was real. It was real. In the sense, I felt the wind. I felt the sun. I was outside, right in this house, in my backyard. Back then, I just moved to Florida in and I um, I moved to Florida. My sister Anna, she was into gardening. I have a big yard. I want mango trees. I was into that. I went to Home Depot. I got my supplies. I was gardening in the backyard. So I built. So to give you a little bit content. Real thing. Re this is reality, okay? I went to Home Depot. I built a raised bed, a raised um, bed, raised raised bed, flower pot. And my sister and I had two weeks. We were going back and forth. We were excited. I just moved from New York to Florida. She's here, Anna. I love you. And um. Yes, um, we were going back and forth. Judy, you have to do this. And I say, Judy, but you, I planted the, the raised bed in the wrong area. But I said, no, because when I, this, this window, I want to wake up, see the first thing is my garden. I want flowers. Guys, if you know me, you know I love flowers. And tulips are my favorite. And I'm just saying that because in my other, my more videos come to come, I'm gonna tell you. Anyway, just that little tidbit. So I said, no, I wanna raise it here. But what happens, I had these big, big trees that blocks the sun and me and my sister were arguing, that's real life. In the dream, the, the vision, I woke up, from this bed and I got ready I got I went to the bathroom and brushed my teeth I did my coffee I already had a plan how to plant my my plants I am in the backyard in the garden I am not gonna go to more details because after that I'm not gonna diminish the the what's the video okay there's another video i'm gonna link it what this is all about um i woke up i was soaked in wet i was wet 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 i was wet i woke up and i was soaked in wet. i'm telling you i was water i was water I was shaking. I was a hot mess. I couldn't, I couldn't eat. I couldn't have my breakfast. I couldn't drink. I couldn't think. I was walking around my house in circles. I didn't know what that means. I, well, I know what that means, but I didn't know what that means to me, what I'm supposed to do. Well, I knew what I'm supposed to do, but in the shock, the sh I was shocked. I was shocked. Like, how do you do that? How, how do you go from not knowing to knowing? 
how do you live after knowing how do you how do you process how do you process and i knew exactly what he wanted me to do he knew he knew he i knew i'm not gonna act dumb here no he god would tell you exactly he would tell you exactly what he wants you to do i couldn't eat i couldn't sleep i couldn't i was a hot mess i was jonah i was jonah i was running away Oh, I didn't have, I didn't live three days in, in, in the whale. Oh, no. I was a mess. I was a mess after that visit. And I could not be in peace until I did that video. And the reason, and the only reason I, I have a YouTube channel is because of him because of this video right now. Um, I could not, I'm not gonna go in detail to that video because that was eight years ago. That video was eight years ago and it's long overdue. It's long overdue. Um, so this is it. I have grown after eight years and I am to a point where I am going to the next level and I'm going to go back to the basics in this you in this series. You can believe me, you cannot, um, but I'm going to link the video. That's the only proof I have. That's the only proof I have is a different channel. Um, I'm exposing myself there. It's, I, it's a different YouTube channel because I, he helped me create it. I don't know. Uh, my, my husband's tech guy. <laughs> I'm just a housewife. Mother of three kids. Trying to love Jesus in this world. Of, and, and then this is me loving jesus back um the video is it's really intense i'm very raw i'm not hiding it i am not sugarcoating it um this is it so guys just to wrap it up a little bit in this book i'm gonna start drawing until i can no more until my last breath until I'm an old lady and I cannot express it anymore. Guys, be good, be kind, be safe. I love you all. Bye.